Hello friends, welcome to BSC Agriculture. If you are coming to my channel for the first time, then don't forget to hit the subscribe button, your subscription and likes are always motivating us. So let's move to the video. In this video, we are going to see about fundamentals of pathology. I am going to cover the definition of plant pathology as well as the history of plant pathology. So which is going to be our first lecture in plant pathology. And while seeing about a normal definition of plant pathology, pathos, which is said to be known as suffering and logos, which is a knowledge. So we can be able to derive a definition from these words. So it is said to be a branch of agriculture or biological science which used to deals with the cause, causal symptoms or mode of spread and control measures of plant diseases. So please remember these words. Mm, and in these lectures of plant pathology, we are mainly going to see about the plant diseases. And in this first lecture, we are mainly going to cover most of the years so please try to remember those years and concept they were developed by different scientists so first we are going to see the plant disease so while giving a definition for this a plant disease is said to be known as the psychological disorder or structural abnormalities which is mainly done due to the deterioration of plant or any other parts and produce the reduce the economic value of the particular crop in the yield is said to be known as the plant diseases and while seeing about those plant diseases in difference so the any disturbance which can be either a living one as well as the non living agent or environmental factor which used to reduce the quality quantity as well as the production factors so of the particular crop are said to be known as the plant diseases so while seeing in about the impact of plant disease on different human affairs the first one is irish famine so which is said to be done in 1845 which is uh, also known mainly caused by the late blight of potato disease so the scientific name of the organism is phytothera infestans so the ireland has approximately 1 million people used to lose their lives due to starvation only because of the irish famine so they used to shift their cultivation from potato to maize cultivation and uh, so they also used to have a large emigration of people due to this irish famine so millions of people emigrated from ireland to north america which includes the ancestors of john Fed federal kennedy who is said to be known as the 35th president of uac and after that we are going to see the grape wine downing mill in france it is one of the historically important one uh, as well as the late blighted of potato so which is mainly caused by the plasmopora viticola during the years of 1878 to 1882 so it is mainly done and the disease affected mainly in france as well as the other european countries they used to cause around 50 to 75 percentage of crop yield of grape wines in the france and european countries after that the one of the main and important disease in sri lanka so which used to shift their cultivation from coffee to tea cultivation only because of this coffee rust virus so which happened in the period of 1875 to 1886 the causative organism is hemlia vastatrix and where they used to reduce the production from 100 metric tons to 2 point metric tons so the people of the sri lanka used to shift their cultivation from coffee to tea and as well as the panama wilt of banana so the causative agents are fusarium wilt which is a panama disease so the scientific name of the organism are fusarium oxysporum form of species cubans and the panama wilt is said to be one of the epidemic in panama during the period of 1890s the central american as well as the caribbean banana industry suffered mainly due to this panama wilt and they also used to have a threatening 80 percent of world's banana production was said to be done in those places were mainly reduced and the sikotoka leaf spot in fiji island so mycosporla musicola is the causative agent so they used to give this name as sikotoka leaf spot is mainly because the first recognized leaf spot of this disease is mainly in the sikotoka valley of fiji in 1963 so they used to give a yield loss of around 50 percentage or more which also used to cause the premature ripening of the banana crops and after that the citrus studiza in argentina which is said to cause a quick lifting of the yield as well as the leaves in these 
trees so which is mainly caused by citrus trichoderma virus so the aphids toxoctrus and citrusidas is said to be in one of the vector for causing these virus in the plants and uh, since 1930 around 18 million citrus trees were dead due to the citrus trichoderma virus and uh, they also used to cause the sore orange root stalks in these plant stalks and after that the st antony fire of holy fire so which is said to be known as the god's disease so due to the consumption of ergot or contaminated rice or jor or bajra so they used mainly caused by the organism clarice species and they used to produce ergotoxin ergometrin as well as the ergentin europe and india in 17th century used to call these diseases as the gods disease so they name it as st antony fire as well as the holy fire disease of wheat bajra jowa etc and uh, after that we are going to see one of the historical impacted one which is a bengal famine which is caused in 1942 which is known as the brown spot of rice the helminthosporium oryzae which used to cause the 7 to 10 million people died due to mainly of starvation in these periods and after that the bunch it up of banana so which is mainly caused by bbtv virus bunch it up banana virus so where the main vector is black aphids so they are mainly used to be destroy hill bananas as well as the virpoxi bananas and in low plain hills the sirimalai and kollimalai hills they used to have a greater impact of diseases and uh, while seeing about the reduction around 8000 hectare in 1948 is said to be reduced to 2000 hectare production of those hill bananas at now current situation and uh, while seeing about the other uh, evidences of plant pathological diseases we can able to see the wheat rust epidemics in 1946 and 47 bacterial leaf plate of rice in 1963 which is mainly in bihar and red rot of sugarcane during 1938 to 39 in bihar punjab and uttar pradesh and in 1985 to 86 the rice to grow viral disease in tamil nadu is one of the important one. as well as in 1985 to 88 rice blast in tamil nadu and while seeing about the different important inventions as well as the methodicals happened during this different era or the in ancient era which is around 370 to 286 bc as well as the dark era of 4 460 AD to 17th century as well as the autogenic era which is in between the 17th to mid of 19th century and in pathogenic era where the major developments are said to be made during the period uh, of 1885 to 1909 so while seeing about them first we are going to see about the ancient era so those plant diseases are said to be noted in rig veda and the ayurveda which is said to be around 1500 to 500 bc old year books as well as the artha shastra by kautalya is one of the book which used to denote the plant diseases which was written in the period of 321 to 186 bc and after that the greek philosopher theocritus who used to describe as well as the enquiry into plants record the occurrence of crop maladies cause as well as the care of the disease in during the period of 370 to 286 bc and the roman which is used to know as the god's punishment to the sins and robigo the god of diseases as well as the robigalio so the special festival which is celebrated to reduce the diseases during the period of roman times and uh, in dark era so there is a very different devel- little development plant pathology so the few scientist who used to describe as well as write about the symptoms of plant diseases and its control measures example in lawn sectory um, you can able to see the virksha ayurveda from the surpal who is an ancient indian used to write the books and in autogenic era in between the 17th to mid of 19th century um, the robert hook so who is the first one to develop a simple microscope 
So you used to study the minute structure of fungi and in 1960 and in 1665 yeah micrographia who is, which is a book used to describe microscope as well as the telescopic observations observations and as well as the Anton Leeuwenhoek who is said to be known as the Dutch worker we, he used to develop a compound microscope in 1675 and he used to visualize bacteria in 1683 under his own microscope so he is said to be known as the father of bacteriology and after that we are going to see is Pierre Antonio Michael so he used to live in the period of 1679 to 1737 who is said to be known as the Italian botanist so he is the first person who used to make a detailed study of fungi in 1729 so he used to create a nova planetarium genera in 19, 1729 which used to comprise of 1900 plants including 900 fungi in his own book and after that we are going to see is Matthias Stillard in 1755 who is a French botanist explaining the cross of crops as well as the blanket of grains of wheat so he used to give the experimental evidence of the contagious of wheat buns in the wheat crop so they he is told that these wheat buns are said to be transmitted by black dust from diseased plants of the wheat to the new ones and after that the ch person so who is said to be in south africa and the synopsis medic methodica fungarium in 1801 is said to be done and the normal feature of uridinals, estelagenes, as well as the gastromycets are said to be made by him. And after that, the Elias Magnus phrase, so who is said to be known as the Swedish mycologist as well as the botanist, who used to give us the system of mycologism, so which is the taxonomy of mushrooms, is said to be described by him after that we are going to see the prevost so who used to give a first experimental proof on wheat dust which is said to be caused by the fungus so he used to dip the seeds in copper sulfate which used to control these diseases of wheat dust and after that while coming to the pathogenic era which is one of the important era where you can able to have different years based on this one so which is in between 1885 to 1909 so first we are going to see is Anton Dean Barry in 1831 to 1888 so who is said to be known as the German surgeon as well as the botanist, micrologist as well as the mycologist who is said to be known as the father of plant pathology as well as the founder of modern mycology and late blight of potato he used to give the definition as well as what is the cause for the late bite of potato and uh, developmental history of myxomites which is a slime molds are said to be made by Anton D. Barry so while seeing about him he is the first one who used to coin the term mycetosa and also used to demonstrate sexuality in fungi as well as disproved spontaneous generation and uh, heterosism in wheat rest lichens association of fungi as well as algae and also he used to coin the word symbiosis in 1879 so after that we are going to see Louis Pasteur so who is said to be known as the father of microbiology and also give us the germ theory uh, who is said to be known as the French chemist as well as the microbiologist after that we are going to see the Robert Roach so he is mainly known for his coach postulates and he was awarded the Nobel Prize in Physiology Medicine in 1905. So he is mainly important cause for the isolation of anthrax, tuberculosis and corla is made by him. After that we are going to see T.J. Birrell. So who is said to be known as the father of plant bacteriology. Who used to describe the diseases, fire blight of apple caused by the bacterium as well as the EF. Smith provoked that bacterium is Erbenia amylovora and he also used to give the wilt of cucurbits brown and black rot of solanaceous crops and the bovine which is the cause of club root of cabbage 
which is mainly caused by plasmodifora brassicae as well as the rat disease of potato and uh, which is caused by syncretum endobiotum and after that we are going to see alexis mildred so the downy mildew of grapes which is called caused by plasmopora viticola he used to give the first chemical fungicide which is bordeaux mixture of lime plus copper sulfate was introduced by him which is the world's first fungicide after that we are going to see oscar buffrell who used to show us the pure culture technique of fungi as well as we are going to see harold henry flor during the period of 1000 900 to 1991 who is said to be an american so he is responsible for breeding of disease resistant cultivars as well as he used to give the interaction between host as well as the parasite of diseases he used to describe the flax rust diseases caused by melanspora lini and also he used to give the definition of gene for gene hypothesis and after that we are going to see van der plank who is said to be known as the father of epidemiology as well as the st garrett father of biological control and sir edwin john butler so who is during the period of 1874 to 1943 so who is said to be known as the british mycologist and plant pathologist the first director of imperial bureau of mycology in england who used to do the monography of indian wheat trust in 1906 and we are going to see sir edwin john butler so who used to give monography of pithium in 1907 as well as he also used to write the book about the fungal fungi and diseases in plants so he is said to be known as the father of indian plant pathology so please remember the name the father of indian plant pathology is sir edwin john butler and uh, jahangir ferdunji daster who is said to be known as the colleague of butler first indian plant pathologist to make detailed study of fungi as well as the plant diseases so he used to describe the diseases of potato on castor caused by the genus phytophthora and he used to establish the species of p parasitica from the castor in 1913 and gs kulkarni who is said to be known as the student of ej butler who used to generate a detailed information of downy mildew and sl ajaker who studied the wilt disease of cotton sugar cane smut as well as the ergot of jowar and after that we are going to see the karamchand mehta who during the period of 1894 to 1950 who discovered the life cycle of stem rust of wheat barberry and alternate host which used to does not play an important role in preservation of rust fungus in india so they used to create the two monographic entitled for the studies on cereal rust in india as well as the paxinia pathway so he is the first one to give how the paxinia pathway is to be done and uh, after that we are going to see bb munker so while seeing about this inventions as well as the records who is said to be known as the second mycologist trained under butler he used to give the control of cotton wilt by using resistant varieties and uh, he is one of the important scientist who used to create the establishment of indian phytopathological society which is shortly known as the ips in 1948 and also he used to return the textbook of fungi and plant diseases so after some of the important scientist name or sr bose so who used to classification of polyprase and isolated polyprin from polypus as well as the mg thirumal created around 20 new genera and 300 new species of fungi monographed genera of urinals of the world and display genus of india in different groups and the cv subramaniam in 1971 who used to give hypomyces particularly in fusarium and jc luther who is said to be in 1953 who used to give solar heated seed treatment of wheat to eliminate the seed borne diseases in wheat and while seeing about the virological scientist a adolf meyer in 1886 who is to tell about the sap transmission of tobacco mosaic virus and dmitry ivanovsky who is a russian scientist in 1892 who used to give the explanation about tme pass through bacteriological filter as well as the bajernik who 
who is a scientist from Poland in 1998 so who used to give the TMV is contagium vivum fluidum and who is one of the important founder of known as the founder of virology and W. H. Stanley 1935 who used to give the crystallization of virus and also awarded the Nobel Prize for his works and Kazin in 1966 who used to describe the satellite virus so these are the pictures of Beijing as well as that of Mayer and the TMV symptoms and some other important scientists are Diner and Reimer who gives the potato spindle table viral and Doi and Ishii Pytoplasma, Davis et al. Spiroplasma as well as in the constant and uh, while seeing some other important scientist Norman Ernst Borlaug who is said to be known as the father of green revolution one of the American biologists so he is the one who saved the billions of life so because of his idea of green revolution millions and millions of life were saved where the food materials are produced in his period and he also give give it's to be known as the Nobel laureate for his work and after that we are going to see the M.S. Swaminathan who is the Indian father of Green Revolution so the before one is said to be known as the father of Green Revolution and the M.S. Swaminathan who is said to be known as the Indian father of Green Revolution who is also placed as Director General of ICR as well as the Director General of IRRI so ICR is Indian Council of Agricultural Research as well as IRRI Indian Rice Research Institute so he is the founder as well as the chairman of M. Swaminathan Research Foundation one of the important person to prevent the death of millions and millions of people in India during the Bengal famine periods so I have given the lecture notes in description so if you have any doubt please comment in the section and join us in the Instagram page and if you like the video like it and share it with your friends and please comment in this subscribe and hit the bell icon to get regular updates so thanks for watching the video i'll catch you up in next videos